So I'm Jim Wilder, Vehicle Development Manager for the Challenger Charger Programs uh, at SRT. We're here at Club Motorsport in New Hampshire. We're driving the new 2019 Hellcat Red Ice. Highest horsepower Challenger we make, 797 horsepower. Uh, it's truly a marriage of a Demon and a Hellcat. That's what we end up with the Red Eye. This engine has a supercharger on it, a 2.7 liter supercharger. It's belt driven, there's a pulley right here that's driven off the crankshaft and it spins the screws inside the blower that make boost. So this, this supercharger will make up to 14.6 pounds of boost. That's a lot of boost. Turbochargers are a different animal. They also produce boost inside the intake manifold, but they run off the exhaust from the engine. So the expelled burnt gas comes out and spins a turbine wheel on a turbocharger that in turn turns another turbine on the other side that boosts the air going into the intake manifold. Two different ways of kind of accomplishing the same things. There's pros and cons to both of them. We chose a supercharger for these cars for the instant boost right off the throttle because of it, the uh, belt driven nature of the design. So over on this side, we've got the, uh, the air filter. It's an open air box. This is from the Demon. It, has, it ends up having three inlets. There's one on the bottom of the air box, kind of in the fender well. There's one through the headlamp here. That's something that we've had on Hellcat for some time now. And with this engine, with this power level, we needed a third inlet to reduce both restriction and to get more air into the engine. So on the hood, we have two hood scoops, and those two hood scoops feed directly in to the top of the air box, uh, providing it more airflow. And that's what that really is what allows us to make the full power that this thing makes.